Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report, back again with a new update adventure and this one relates to the latest Windows 11 Dev Channel build update, more specifically the build 25131 which contains a good set of important fixes and as well a significant update to the Microsoft Store application. So let's dive in and talk about it. Microsoft has rolled out a new update to the Store app for the insiders in the Dev Channel with the following changes and improvements. Native ARM 64 support which means the Store app will get a better experience on the ARM64 devices, so in conclusion you'll see faster and better performance when you use the application. In the same time, the app update system was also improved so that, for example, when you're working in a specific app, the store will make it exempt for an automatic update so you don't lose any important work. I think this is super nice and efficient, and as Microsoft stated, you can then update those apps later on. Along with this update, you should also be able to experience faster navigation as the store app is now better optimized and in the same field, the navigation has also improved improved when it comes to the user interface for movies and TV shows. That means that once you've selected a TV show or movie, you can see all your viewing options in a single list. So this basically wraps up the Microsoft Store update, which to be honest sounds pretty promising. Moving on to the fixes category, the most important ones to mention are the following. This update fixed an issue causing some insiders PCs with certain AMD processors to bug check and roll back when attempting to upgrade to last week flight. So if you're one of those you can feel at ease now trying to get the latest updates with no danger of getting your computer rolled back to a previous build. At the same time, this update fixed an issue which was causing some insiders with secondary accounts on their PCs to not be able to upgrade to the latest build. This probably related to a security error with the OS not being able to recognize the secondary accounts but is now solved and good to go. This update also fixed some issues with the search. For example, searching for something like percent app data percent should now show a proper folder icon and not just a blank square. Also, when selecting open file location for a search result, he should now select the file in the folder again now and not just open the folder. This is a minor issue, but nevertheless properly fixed. And lastly, other important fixes are the following. The update fixed an issue which was leading to certain frame rate monitoring applications impacting game performance. This is super important because many of us use frame rate monitoring applications, so it's quite nice to hear it's working now properly. And another fix worth mentioning related to an issue that could cause rounded corners to unexpectedly become pixelated at certain scale factors. And that's pretty much the summary of the fixes and the improvements in this build. There are of course other fixes, but this we thought to be the most crucial in this update. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm curious to hear your comments about it in the section below. As usually, feel free to hit the like button and of course subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thank you.